Uh, hello guys, it's me, Blood Rain Wolf. I'm gonna continue playing Resident Evil Revelations for you guys. So this is episode one, Into the Depths. This sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. It took a full 11 years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never before had solar energy been used to supply power to an entire city. But in 2004, Veltro, a terrorist group opposing the city's development, launched a bioterrorist attack. They not only released a virus, but also several creatures, known as bioorganic weapons, further complicating the situation. This launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC, the world's leading counter-bioterror organization operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter-bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests of any one country, went in as observers to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. Media outlets around the world began to refer to the incident as the Terra Grigia Panic. Following the incident, the FBC announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terra Grigia remains inaccessible a silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. So that it was gonna be getting taken by a seagull or something, but oh, so much for that. Genesis Manual version 109. Genesis, the nickname of a high level bioscanner currently being tested and developed by the Global Pharmaceutical Consortium. Sorry if I don't pronounce things right, it's yeah. It bounces special 
synchrotron radiation off of a target in order to analyze it. Viral analysis is <laughs> sorry. Analysis. It is possible to detect and analyze even the smallest amount of viruses. Vaccine manufacturing. Since version 104, it has been possible to produce simple vaccines from the viral analysis data. Detection using synchrotron radiation, it is possible to detect specific objects. The data for both medical herbs, ETC, are registered within the internal memory for testing. If a detectable object is nearby, the indicator in the lower right area of the monitor will light up. And that is the end of that. Ah, look at this mess. Oh, they're rotted to hell. Skin so pale. I've never seen anything like it. Use the Genesis to get a reading on it. Genesis requires a decent sample size to get an accurate reading. Scan the carcasses on the beach and send me your data. I'm getting something from inside it. Careful now. Don't worry, I've done this before. Got something. What is this? If it's an engineered mutation, this could prove a link. I'll run some tests on this. Continue with the investigation. I suppose. So why'd you quit the FBC for this outfit? I wanted to be more involved. I wanted to fight. I see you two are okay. Continue with the investigation, but proceed with extreme caution.
where we don't have room for the ammo uh, too much. Weapon controls. Use weapon with R2. Use weapon while aiming with L1 and R2. Switch weapons with up and down and the plus sign when, you, when using two, carrying two or more. Or you didn't really, unless this is like a walkthrough, you didn't really need to know that. But I just read it for you. So if you scan up to 100%, yeah, the hair says. Getting your analyze rate up to 100% will earn you a health recovery item. The rate you receive will go down if you analyze enemies of the same kind. I've collected enough samples. Good. Get them to me ASAP. Whoa! All clear for now, <laughs> right? Fine. Some peace and quiet. All the day's work for you two, eh? All right, enough chit chat. Get that sample data to me. There you are. Nice work. No doubt about it. These corpses show signs of viral infection. And I bet it's no coincidence they came through the FBC's blockade. Well, we did all we can. Now we wait for the results to come back from HQ. Huh? It's the emergency line. Yeah, it's me. Uh-huh. What? Yes, that's fine. I'll take it from here. We'll have to speed things up. Starting now. Uh-huh. Good. Get to it. Bill, uh, Barker. You two are still on the case. What happened? lost contact with Chris and Jessica. When? How? Oh. We're not certain. I've sent their last known coordinates to your terminals. The signal was lost over the ocean. I thought they were in the mountains chasing Feltro. But judging from their position, they must be... On a ship. I'll go back to HQ. Take charge of the search and rescue. You two will be my eyes out there. Yes, sir. So this is the end of the second video, the next one should be posted soon, so see you in the next one, bye.